Okay, Melody is uh Cubing potatoes. Cubing potatoes. This is for our uh, supper tonight. Yes, because we don't want to come back home and be starving to death. Right. And not have anything to eat. Yeah. Because the last time we did that, you had to go to a crowded fast food restaurant. Right. So we're working at Adventureland, and we'll get off at about 6 tonight. And so when we get home, we'll have a nice hot meal ready to eat. Ready to eat. So This recipe is um, pork loin barbecued with potatoes. And so it doesn't have a lot of ingredients in it. And so yesterday I did some prep work. Okay. And I cut up the, the three pound roast into cubes. So I have the pork roast. Mm hmm. And it's cubed. Cubed. And I found it on sale. It was about, it was one of those quick sales. And so I knew so I need to eat it. Okay, we've got our trusty uh, slow, cooker. slow cooker. And the bag that lines it because I don't like cleaning the inside and having to scrub it. Bags is helpful on cleanup. Let me show you what these bags look like. You can order these. These are the slow cooker bags. You can use them in your slow cooker. Like if you're roasting something, casserole dish, or, or yeah. steaming, yeah, they're super handy. Cause like I said, I don't like to cook something and then have to scrub it clean. Right. Okay, kind of takes the fun out of it. So I have six russet potatoes and I've cut them into some cubes. I'm gonna throw those in. I'm gonna put some salt and pepper on them. No wimpy pepper for us. We right. use the real stuff. And then I'm going to put the cubed pork in there. Okay. And just kind of spread it around. Are we having people over for supper? It looks like a lot. You'll be hungry. <laughs> <laughs> An hour. More salt and pepper. More salt and pepper. Okay, now here's the biggest part of this, and it's not even that big of a deal. This is dried mustard. Okay. I had to buy some of this because I didn't have any in my pantry. Okay. It's going to take one teaspoon of that. barbecue sauce please sir it takes a cup we're gonna mix it in there whoa I almost got that on my pants So I've mixed the dry mustard in with one cup of barbecue sauce and then you just kind of spoon it on top of your pork roast. And that's the hickory smoked barbecue sauce and um, you can use whichever barbecue sauce you think you would like best, but we chose hickory smoke. And so I'm just gonna kind of spread it out over that. as I can in that. Okay. I still have some barbecue sauce left in this and that's for later so mm. don't throw that out or get rid of it. We never throw barbecue sauce out. We never do. We probably have barbecue sauce in there old enough to start kindergarten. Mm. Okay. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> we use barbecue sauce a lot and we make a lot of our own barbecue sauce but yeah. we didn't have time this morning. No. 
Now we're going to set this on low. It's supposed to cook for eight or nine hours. All right, it's on low. It's on low, and so we're ready. So that's it. Yeah, we'll see you after work. All right. Here's where it's okay, we just got off work. I went ahead and changed my clothes, but Melody's in here still working. Still in uniform. Still in uniform. And so I was going to finish up this. We came in, it smelled really good. Okay. Someone once told me that the that there's nothing nicer than coming home from a day of work and smell food cooking, no matter who cooked it. Okay, so remember the barbecue sauce that we had left out of this? Sure. I warmed it up okay. in the microwave because it was it had been in the refrigerator, and so I didn't want to put cold sauce sure. on the meat. But that's what it looks like right now. Mm. So I'm going to put some more barbecue sauce on it just to give it a little bit of extra sauce on it. Mm. We're going to spread it around. Okay. Mm. That's pretty tender. Yeah. I wish I had sprayed this bag with Pam. I think it's going to be okay, though. Okay. All right. Let's serve it up. Let's see what we have. Let's do it. So you have the potatoes are kind of on the bottom. Okay. And the pork is kind of on the top. Okay. If I wanted to get really fancy with this meal, fancier, I'd probably put a little salad together, some green beans. Oh, Ooh, you, careful. That's your plate. Okay. <laughs> Anyway, the meat looks nice and tender. Oh, yeah. Well cooked. And so. Yeah. And there you have it. All right. It meat, looks delicious. Meat and potatoes. Meat and potatoes. That's all you need. Barbecued pork, wine, and potatoes. Yeah. All, all right. right. See you next time. Okay.